With an overtime goal, the Shepherd Rams picked up their first one of the year, defending their home field and taking a 2-1 win over Lock Haven. Lucas Medina's golden goal sealed the Rams' victory in overtime. Well, I believe uh, Matt D'Amico had it. He gave it to uh, Alex Jones on the, le- on the right. And with his nice left, he just put it across. And I think it flicked over Josh Wise, and then it just took a bounce. And I well, I got a foot on it. So it might not have been pretty, but it was in. It was a game-winning goal. And it's tied out here, so we're glad we ended it early. <laughs> After scoreless first half, the physical play picked up, with both teams scrapping over each and every loose ball. Timber slayed when the Rams' Valentin Rhodes and Lock Haven's Kevin Wolf collided on the sidelines, but cooler heads prevailed and neither team was penalized for the rough play. Despite all the pushing and shoving, both teams managed to find the net once each in the second half. The Bald Eagles caught Shepard flat-footed when Martin Pelt scored in the 46 minutes to give Lock Haven the lead. The Rams tied the game at 1-0 in the 50th minute when Jeffers Frazier scored on a cross from Medina. Neither team could find the net for the rest of the regulation, setting up a golden goal overtime scenario. Medina scored in the third minute of overtime on a feed from Shane Lauren on a ball that confused even the cameraman, picking the ball off in the air and bearing it in the back of the net to give the Rams a 2-1 win. You know, we went down a goal, the guy showed a lot of heart and a lot of character coming back to get a goal back, and then just really pushed hard in that brief overtime period so we could get the winning goals. Just a, a, a good emotional high for us. I think we still got some work to do, but as far as uh, commitment and heart goes, I couldn't have asked more from him. Though the Rams' offense gets most of the highlight, the defense held strong almost all game, saved the laps to start the second half. The Rams limited the Bald Eagles to eight shots, seven on goal, while Edgar, Lopez, and Gia registered six saves. I thought we responded great. The team came, kept their heads up. Uh, nobody gave up. Everybody decided to keep working hard, gave it 100%. Everybody said, let's get this back, let's get the goal. We got it right back in the first 10 minutes. We got this game going. We got into overtime. That guys came out, said, let's keep it up. Intensity never went down. Everything worked great. With the win, Shepard improved to 1 0, while Lock Haven drops to 0 1. The Rams return to action on Sunday when they travel to Millersville for a 4 p.m. game. This has been Ben Gibson for the Picket. Thank you for watching, and go Rams!